All right, you guys, so we have a RAV4 2012 key, okay? And we have uh, the x -Force Universal Wire Remote head key for Toyota. So we're about to generate the remote right now with our VVDI key tool. So we're gonna go back from the main menu. We're gonna go to remote slash smart program. We're gonna go to remotes. We're gonna go to Asia. And then we're gonna go to Toyota. Okay, enter. Now we're gonna look for RAV4. Okay. Now it's a 2012, okay. So this is this is gonna be our FCC, okay. HYQ12 BBY, okay. So we have our our circuit board connected to our wire. No battery is in it. No battery. So we're gonna press generate to generate it. Success. So now we're gonna put our battery back inside the circuit board, put it inside our key, and program our key first before we cut it just to make sure it works, okay? All right, you guys, so we're in the RAV4 2012, okay? We have our auto pro pack connected to the OBD. So we're gonna go ahead and stick the original key that's programmed into the ignition, turn our ignition switch on. Then we're gonna go to Toyota. We're gonna agree. Now we're gonna go to remote. We're gonna do auto identify, okay? I believe this is a type two, if I'm correct. So it's communicating right now. So this is a type two, like I said, so we're gonna press okay. Now we're gonna program remote, okay? So it says switch ignition to on position and open driver door. So we're opening the driver door. We have a universal wired remote here. So we're gonna press yes. By source. Okay, so let's press lock and unlock together for one second. And then press lock. Perfect. So you guys heard that beep. So that means that our universal um, wired key is programmed. Okay. So now we're going to press OK. Program success. So let's go ahead and let's try our keys out. Make sure they work. Okay. Close your door. So this is a new one right here. Perfect, you guys. So it works like a charm. So this one's by X Horse, okay, you guys? This one, like let's say you don't have a remote for a certain um, Toyota, you can just go on your VBDI key tool, enter the FCC ID that you need, and voila, you can make it to any um, vehicle that you need, okay? This is the original one, it still works, okay? So part two, let's go clone the chip and insert it to our key, okay? All right, you guys, so now we're gonna clone our key, okay? So this key has a G chip in it, okay? So we're gonna go to our BBDI key tool, okay? We're gonna put the key into the coil. And then we're gonna go to automatic detention clone. We're gonna press okay. Read. So as you guys can see, okay, so it's Toyota G Master, okay, clonable. So then we're gonna press down and then we're gonna read it once again, okay? So you kinda gotta read it twice, okay? And then we're gonna press read once again. Perfect. So now you guys can make as many clones as you guys want. You guys can do 100 clones, okay? So we're gonna clone that chip using our super chip for cloning 4C, 4D, 4.6, and 4.8. You guys have a video on my page, go ahead and check that out to see what other chips we can clone. So 
we're gonna put the small end facing down on our coil and then we're gonna press right okay so we just gotta wait you guys clone success you see the green check mark so now let's go ahead and read it just to make sure that we did it successfully it should read toyota g master perfect toyota g master xt27 that's our clone so we're going to open the chip up and then on our universal wired key there's a little slot right there where we put our chip out okay so i'm going to go ahead and put the chip inside the key and then we're going to go test it out right now okay just to make sure that it works perfect All right, guys, so once again, we're back in the vehicle. Okay, we have our key ready with our chip inside. Okay, super chip. So this is the mobilizer light, okay? Indicating that the key is from there or not. So we're gonna go ahead and stick our new key in there. And this light should turn off. So this light shouldn't be, be flashing, okay? Just to show you guys that you did it correct or not, okay? So let's go ahead and turn on the car. Perfect, you guys. success the vehicle's on security lights off we successfully cloned our key okay so thank you guys for watching if you guys like this video and it helped you guys out make sure you hit like subscribe to my channel for more cool videos with a lot of cool information okay